Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's Carrie here from Foster's Fields Handmade Soap and Soy Candles. Today I am making uh, blackberry vanilla soap. In my pot here I have everything melted for my fragrance oil recipe. There's palm oil, olive oil, coconut oil, um, apricot oil, cocoa butter, and castor oil. So I'm going to blend this up. Um, first of all we'll get our lye in there. And then we're going to blend this up. There we go. Pouring my lye over my little spatula here just to prevent some of the bubbles from getting in to the soap. Still making some bubbles, but it helps. Put that in there. Okay, so we're going to blend this up to a light trace and then we'll add our um, fragrance oil. First, I'm going to plug in my. <laughs> Plug in my blender. Uh, one of those days. Okay, here goes. Everybody is enjoying their April and their home home time with family right now. We've got everybody home. I've been homeschooling my kids, which has been not bad. It wasn't so good in the beginning. It was tricky to figure out how to do everything. But now that we've gotten on to the ball of things, it's actually not too bad. Kids are doing pretty good. got this kind of to a light trace and everything is blended together so I'm gonna go ahead and put the fragrance oil in right, and here is my pre-measured fragrance oil we'll get that in there this is one of my favorite fragrances I make a lot of things with this fragrance. <laughs> All right, let's get that in there. So I'm just going to go ahead and move my um, blender out of the way for a second so I can pour some soap into other things. So let's just get this out of the way. So I'm going to go and separate this into a couple of portions here. My colorants for today are activated charcoal and I have titanium dioxide which is going to go into my main batter and then this one here is a blend of um, Arabian Nights and Glitz and Glam both of these I get from Voyager um, soap and candle here in Canada all right so let's go and separate this off here into a couple of batches Clean that up, make it a mess. All right. When I do titanium dioxide in the pot, I want to make sure I have all these bits down back down from my pouring so they all get the titanium dioxide. All right, so we're gonna go and add these. These colorants have been pre-mixed with a little bit of um, water. Actually, that's a lie. This one's mixed with water, and my my charcoal I actually mix with um, a little bit of glycerin just because it doesn't mix up very well in water. So I'm gonna go ahead and plop that in there. Get it out there. Okay. Get that in there. And then my titanium dioxide is going into the rest of my batter here. So we'll put that. 
that in there. And then I just blend these up from lightest to darkest. So I'm going to start by blending my titanium dioxide into the main pot. this to be a little bit thick when I pour it because I don't want it to all blend together. So I'm actually going to give that one more little mix. So I've got some untitanium dioxide parts in it. Sometimes I find the soap hides in the corners of my pot so I just like to give it a good scrape and get everything mixed in. All right so then we're going to mix this one up. Charcoal blast. Scraped out. I'm just gonna get rid of this blender here. All right. So for this batch, um, I do part of it, which is these colors, and then I do a bit of a pot swirl. So I'm gonna go ahead and put the pot swirl in. my little front and center here and I'm just going to I'm not even going to mix that or anything I'm just going to go ahead and pour it right in and I'm backwards here I seem to set this mold backwards in my camera, so I'm just going to try and turn it here. Alright, get everything out of the pot that you can. Just want all that soap in the mold, not in the pot. And I'm just going to take these guys and put them on either side. I'm holding my spatula in to kind of break the fall a little bit. Just start with a little bit of that and then I'm going to actually, you know what? I'm going to put a little bit more of that. Sometimes I feel like I'm talking to myself more than the video. Okay, and then I'm going to go on this other side and I'm going to do the same thing just kind of break the fall a little bit and put this down this side right. and then we'll just continue mm -hmm. 
Oh, this smells yummy. This and my raspberry jasmine soap are two of my most popular soaps. Need to be ready when things get back. I know I've I've had some cancelled shows in the last few months. Um, all my spring shows have been cancelled so far. I've got one more that I'm not sure about. It's not until June. Hopefully things are back to normal and I can get to that show at least. Uh, it's what my one of my outdoor shows, which is really nice. So we'll see. Fingers crossed that everything is going to be a go by the time that comes around. Alright, we're just going to put that in. There we go. Alright, scrape it as much as I can of that too. I make more of a mess when I'm on camera. I'm at a weird angle here. Okay. So I'm just going to take my stick. And then I just go clean up around here. Like so. And then I'm just going to go through the middle of this one. And then in a figure eight kind of fashion. Just like that. And then it just kind of blends those two together. I'm going to knock this on the ground and make some air bubbles out of this. And I've got soap everywhere here. Okay. I'm just going to knock this on the ground to knock some bubbles out. I'm going to let this set up for a few minutes um, before I go and do anything else. Okay, so usually I fiddle with my tops and then I make them a little bit like peaked, I guess you could say. Um, but this time I have decided that I am not going to do that. I kind of like the way the swirls are for a change, so I'm just going to hit it with some glitter because who doesn't love glitter? I love glitter. And so I'm just going to hit that like that with some glitter. And there should we have it. This is Blackberry. Um, blackberry Vanilla. Hopefully that's in the camera. Um, this is going to sit for about 24 hours or so and then we'll cut it and I'll show you the inside. See you then.